I guess this is not going to be part of a future upgrade kit for a car, is it? No, basically what this was a pre-engineering unit in order to satisfy the U.S. Code of Operability on Section uh, 35, Section 101. And it was uh, developed uh, as pre-engineering to uh, show the operability of all the different operational parameters of water fuel cell. But in actuality, the entire technology you see here is really reduced down to the water fuel cell injectors you see right here. So which this, this is the only thing that's needed? for upgrading a car? No, we have actually solved the problem. Uh, there's no storage of hydrogen whatsoever. The water goes into the injector, which now allows it to go into a high pulse voltage zone, which performs the electrical polarization process. So the water is only converted into thermal explosive energy as it enters the injector. So the thermal explosive energy is now occurring inside the engine. The basic system works. It has for a long time. Wow. That's it.